Hey there programmers, welcome back to Pocket Code Tutorials. My name is CodeGreen01 and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the random function even more. So let's go ahead and open up Pocket Code and go into the random uh, program that I created. So as you guys can see here, we only have an object called square. Well, what we're going to be doing today is using the random function to manipulate the object to square. So let's go ahead and go into the object in scripts and what we want to do is set a data variable for this object. So we'll go ahead and set the variable to sqre for square square as in square sqre and we'll, what you want to put inside of here is functions and random and then whatever numbers you want so I'm going to do 50 to 100 oh, come on okay there we go and I have that set now what you want to do after that is make a broadcast so we're going to broadcast a message called random rndm for short why not? And then, oops, when that object receives random, what we want to happen is anything basically. So, hmm, do we want to change the size by a random? Do we want to set the color by a random? Uh, hmm, let's try, let's try the size. And what you want to do for this is set size to data sqre. And how do we get this to run forever? Well, all we got to do is stick the top script in with a forever loop. Boom. Now that it will always uh, randomize uh, the size variant between 50 and 100 in the side of the set variable statement. So let's go ahead and play the program. And as you guys can see, the, the object square is changing in between a random 50 to 100 in size. So that's one way of using the random function to manipulate your objects inside of your program or even use it for just a cool animation effect. And there's many other ways you can use this also. Say, for example, you can use set color, set transparency, and set brightness. See, let's try set brightness drop set brightness and use sqre and as you guys can see it will switch in between a different brightness uh, like randomly so it gives that that kind of scary good like glitchy effect so like that would be something useful for like a scary video game or something with some creepy music you know like a background that uh flutters or whatever like a lights are coming on and off and or fluttering you know that's a pretty neat way of using that using that random function and let's see instead of set brightness how about let's, let's try something else let's try set color and then go ahead go into data qre and let's try changing this up to like uh, five and three hundred and see what happens And as you guys can see, uh, that square will change in between a random color uh, infinitely uh, using that simple script that we just created uh, and also using the random function. And like I said, you can just use that basically through um, anything. You can manipulate the object with its brightness, size, and anything in here basically. You fill in with data, put that data variable in there, it will randomize it period that's all there is to it so um yeah guys i hope you liked this tutorial um if you did make sure you uh leave a like and if you really really like this video go ahead hit uh that subscription button and that bell notification icon right next to it because i will be uploading more tutorials and uh yeah guys uh keep this brand just flowing um also before i leave um i want you guys to go ahead and go over uh, to the place where I download this app called Discord because we have something new called the Pocket Code English server where people can go to find help if they are having problems in Pocket Code. So any of you English speaking uh, programmers out there that need help and would like more guidance, uh, go ahead and go to the Play Store, download Discord. I'll be leaving a link to our Discord in the description below. If you want to go ahead and follow that, I'll be leaving it there. So. Uh, like I said, come in and join our Discord community, and yeah, we're going to have a lot of fun there. Uh, things such as game builds, uh, meetings, things like that, uh, we're all going to be talking with each other. So make sure you go ahead and go check that out. And uh, yeah, guys, keep those brain juices flowing. Your boy, Cook Green Zero One, signing out.